Does Matt really want a wife that's constantly creating drama? Or does he want a wife like me? Katie. Katie, will you accept this rose? Absolutely. Katie over me, are you blind? Katie's disgusting, we've known that for weeks now. She's been disgusting. Time to go. These girls are just telling him complete And I'm so proud of myself for saying to him the truth. Chelsea. And I'm actually kind-hearted, honest, genuine, hardworking, fun, loyal. I'm like the most loyal. And I'm not like fake. Ladies, Matt is the final rose tonight. When you're ready. Ladies, I'm sorry. You did not receive a rose. Take a moment. Say your goodbyes. I'm upset because I know I didn't do anything wrong. It's good meeting you. Likewise. Thank you. Bye. I was invested. I cared about him. So, I think he made a huge mistake. I honestly feel so sorry for you that you would listen to hearsay and not all of the facts behind a situation. So, goodbye. You think I'm gonna go hug him goodbye? No. And he just stared at me. Like, how dare you? He is not my king, and I'm still a queen. Matt is a jester. The fact that, like, he chose Katie over me, ugh. Yeah, Matt, I feel sorry for you with your choices. Cheers to just moving forward and starting this week with a clean slate and to finding love with Matt. Yes. Mm -hmm. Cheers. I would be very surprised if the girls are like, OK, that I left. The whole house is going to feel like that I'm gone. Like, I brought so many people joy. Here's to turning a new page. Hopefully a better week next week in the house. Cheers. Whatever. Matt's not the guy for me. I'm never dating another Matt as long as I live, ever. I hate that name now. Here's to love. Love. love.